Teletubbies star dead, Tinky Winky actor Simon Shelton Barnes dies aged 52 inches. The actor played the purple Teletubby in the iconic children's TV show. The 52-year-old father of three, who lived in Amptill, Bedfordshire, was the uncle of in-betweeners star Emily Attack and the brother-in-law of Paul Dark actor Robert Dawes. Tributes have poured in for trained ballet dancer and choreographer Simon, with 28-year-old Emily sharing a headshot of the actor on Instagram. She captioned the post, My wonderful uncle Simon Barnes has been taken from us all so suddenly. The kindest and most talented man you could ever wish to meet. Loved by all who knew him, and will be forever. My wonderful uncle Simon Barnes has been taken from us all so suddenly. The kindest and most talented man you could ever wish to meet. Loved by all who knew him, and will be forever. Ex a post shared by Emily Attack, at Emily Attack official. On Jan 19, 2018 at 4.33 a.m. PST. Son Henry wrote on Facebook, I lost my lovely dad. He was the kindest and most gentle man I knew and I love him more than anything. I always used to be embarrassed as a child that he was a dancer and an actor but now I couldn't be more proud. He is in a better place now and I know he wouldn't want me to be sad, so I'm going to live my life the way he would want me to. Simon took over the role of the handbag carrying character from comedian Dave Thompson. Thompson, who played Tinky Winky when the show first launched on BBC Two back in 1997 was allegedly sacked by production company Ragdoll for implying the character was gay, with the BBC thought to have told the actor that his interpretation of the role was not acceptable. Tinky Winky's sexuality was a hot topic when the show first aired, with American televangelist Jerry Falwell alleging the character was a homosexual role model in 1999. Over speculation over whether the character was gay, Simon responded, the character is supposed to be a three-year-old so the question is really quite silly. Simon was said to initially be reluctant to take over as the Teletubby, having once said, I started my career as a ballet dancer and had just started working as a choreographer. I thought it was a bit of a risky move but it certainly paid off. He then compared starring in the kids program to being a rock star, we used to receive a lot of fan mail from kids and parents. I suppose we were a bit like the Beatles or the take that of children's television. The funeral will take place on the 7 February at the Bedford Crematorium. Family members have asked those attending to wear bright colors to remember Simon. Cult show Teletubbies was brought back for a new BBC series in 2014 after its initial four-year run saw international success. Maddie Darrell, the executive producer, said being asked to remake the show was like being handed the television crown jewels.